On this day, two graduate students are giving a Torah to Westchester University that has an extraordinary story behind it. And how they found the Torah is quite a story as well. Action News reporter Dan Quayer reports from Westchester. It is the story of a Torah that triumphed over time and evil. A parchment scroll bearing the Hebrew script of one of the five books of Moses. Five panels that outlasted the Nazis and the people who hid them who may have paid for it with their lives. It is a testament to the, the triumph of the human spirit. Hadassah DeJack and Hillary Bentman, graduate students at Westchester University, were on an educational trip on the Holocaust back in 2012 that took them to Warsaw, Poland, a country where three million people were murdered during World War II at the hands of the Nazis' madness. All because they were Jewish. I can't help thinking about the people who read from it, the people who um, heard it um, chanted in their synagogues and where they where they ended up and how this survived and, and many of, so many of them did not. The two women acquired the Torah from an antiquities dealer who carried a mixture of Judaica and Nazi paraphernalia. He had uh, related to us a story that a gentleman had discovered it in the wall of his home. The Torah had been hidden from the Nazis as they pillaged Jewish neighborhoods. The dealer wanted $1,500 for the panels, money they had to scrape together between them and the other students who were on the trip. I look at this and know how rare it is that a Torah scroll was to survive uh, in Poland because they were being destroyed. So for us to have been able to find this this far after the Holocaust has passed is, is remarkable. It's a miracle. The grad students are dedicating the Torah to the university on this Holocaust Remembrance Day. They hope that it will serve as an important educational tool. Knowing what can happen when hatred runs rampant and bigotry and prejudice are allowed to continue to to study that and to teach others. That's the point of this program and that's the point of this scroll. At Westchester University, Dan Quayar, Channel 6 Action News.